What's up guys, Duckfin Gaming here, aka a Duck Opinion, and I'm gonna play this Newgrounds. It's a point and click adventure game. It's called Free Ice Cream, it's very creepy, but I kinda like it. It's something extremely different, and maybe it'll get, you know, some good views. So it's a point and click game, but you're this little girl who's trapped in this basement in this very creepy, very scary dude's place, and you gotta make your way out. So let's try to make our way out. I've played this game a little bit but I have not beat it. I've played it for like five minutes. I know a few things, but that's about it. But if you guys would like me to do more unique, different type of games that aren't just the normal stuff, you know, maybe some free flash games like these point and click adventures that have different outcomes depending on what you click on, then by all means give it a thumbs up, watch this, let me know of some, let me know you want me to do some different stuff because I feel this is a lot different than the normal stuff I post, the normal than the normal Minecraft and the normal Let's Play. It's a little bit different. So hopefully you like the idea of being different. I want to try to hit all angles on this making videos for YouTube thing, you know? Alright, someone's coming. Better hide. Also, I want to start doing a lot more PC stuff because I've officially ordered my new PC. It's an HP Phoenix PC. And hopefully it's going to be really good and I can run what I want to run, record what I want to record, hopefully. I'll know here by next week when I get it. It said it should be here. It should ship within like a week and then it should be here a few more days after it ships. So we'll see. We'll see. I'll have to wait for an email from them, but enough about me. Let's focus on getting this poor little girl out of here. Alright, so both doors lead to the same area pretty much. This one leads to the living room, this one leads to the kitchen, and they both lead to each other when you're there. Alright, so here's the kitchen. Alright, so there's a door here with a pad, but it doesn't work, and I don't know the number anyway. Can't get out that way. It's a cat food dish. It's empty. The food's there. Some cat food. So she's use the stool and let's get up there and get that cat food. Because we gotta get this little girl out of here. She can't be in this place. She needs to get home. So jump up there and get the cat food, little lady. Nice, nice. So, um, let's get down. Alright, open this. Ooh, poison. Okay, so... Let's go in here into the living room. And there's the cat. It's laying on a duster. Okay. So let's grab that duster. We need that duster. Nope. Not gonna have it. Okay. So then let's feed the cat to get him off the duster. Because we can use that duster to get rid of those cobwebs. And that's about as far as I've gotten before. But we'll see. Alright. Let's use the rat poison. And let's be a mean son of a bitch. And kill the poor little kitty. And let's see what the cat does. It falls on the ground and shits itself. Nice. <laughs> so, now we have the duster. And by the way, you've got to be really careful in this game because if you do something like turn on the TV, the guy will show up. So you can't be making noise. 1977? I wonder, is that the dude? That's kind of creepy. Uh, you, let's use the duster on here. All right. So let's. I don't know. I can only give power to one area. I only have this one live feed, and it's in the living room right now. It's where I can turn on the TV. So I can put it in the basement where I were. The kitchen. I'm not sure about the hall, and I haven't been to the second floor, so I don't know. Put it in the hall. This is the hall, right? So if it's in this area, I'd be able to power this, correct? Or am I just tripping? Alright, so now if that works, let's go put some light upstairs, I guess. Second floor. There. There, my little child. There's some light up there. Oh, but then I'm going to put it in the damn hallway, and it's going to disappear. And then she's going to be like, well, I can't use it because there's no light in the hallway. Alright, so I'm going to need another power converter, so I don't know. Let's try it in the basement, and let's see if there's anything that I didn't notice that could possibly be in the basement. I hate getting stuck on this. Like, why do I get stuck on this screen? Come on. 
Eesh, let's try not to click the power anymore. <laughs> hmm. Yeah, honestly, I don't see nothing down here I could possibly do. So, I mean, let's try it in the kitchen. The thing about a kitchen is the kitchen had that power room, but I don't know about that power room. The kitchen was kind of... Let me remember. That's the place. Now I can't turn on TV and the phone's not going to work or anything. Oh, shit. Hide. I think if I plugged it into a kitchen that the living room wouldn't work. Why is my cat laying dead shit on himself? Who's turning on the TV? What the hell's going on in here? Alright, so the cat's now shitting on me. I don't know the passcode to get out, so I don't really... That's locked. Well, kid, I'm running out of ideas for you because I don't know the password. <gasps> I do know the password, isn't it? Oh, I just, I think, I think I just figured that shit out being all smart and shit. What was the date on here? It's the only friggin' shit, 1977. All right, so let's get out of here. And do 1977. Aha! Oh, look at that. I'm all smart and shit. Alright. Gross. Gross. Let me guess, another power thing's gonna come out of this one. Ugh. Oh, it's, a, it's, a, it's dead Lily. Poor Lily. Got a small key though, I bet that opens up that, uh, that drawer. I haven't been this far in this game yet. So, let's see what's in here. I have no clue. Another fuse. Go figure. I said I needed one earlier, so go figure it'd be another fuse. And I already know. I gotta light up the second floor and light up the power for the uh, electric chair. So, um, you can, like, you know, lose in this game. Like, if the guy catches you, you're kind of... kind of screwed. Like, if, if the guy walks in on you and you don't hide behind something quick enough, he will just... He doesn't come kill you, it's just game, it's just game over. It's kind of weird. I mean, it'd be cool if he, like, went over and just grabbed you. I mean, I don't want to, like, brutally murder this little girl, but, you know. It'd just been something. Alright, little girl, let's go up to the second floor. Does this lead, like, out of the basement? Is that the end, or...? I don't know. Didn't think it was. Oh, it could be, but I want to... I'm curious. I want to know what's behind this door before I go. Door's locked. I think it's the bathroom. Oh, we don't need to see it then. Knew that was a trap just because of the way I was clicking it. Oh, shit. I was like, I don't know what to do. Get on it again. Oh no, he's getting up. Go! Go! <laughs> this is so creepy! He disappeared too. Alright, so... Maybe I can carefully step around that? Alright. Finished! Alright, so I did it. I successfully made my way out of there within 10 minutes. This was just a free indie game. I found on Newgrounds. It was just an adventure point and click game called Free Ice Cream. Hope you guys enjoyed it. You guys want to see me do more random free indie games? Leave it in the comments which ones. And I've already done Slender. Look at my videos. I've already done it. I know you guys are going to ask for it. And I'll do it again when I get my new PC. Thank you guys so much for watching. Give it a thumbs up. Let me know if you want me to play more. Even email me or Facebook me some games you want to see me cover. Talk to you guys later. Dust can fly. Peace.